नमस्कार आप सभी का एक बार पुनः स्वागत है मैं हूं राहुल और आप देख रहे हैं ई विद्या चैनल्स और एन का ऑफिशियल यूट्यूब चैनल दिस इज द टाइम वेन वी ब्रिंग यू द लाइव टेलीकास्ट ऑफ वेबिनार एंड टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू एक्सप्लोर अ जर्नी ऑफ अ नेशनल आई सी टी अवार्डी टीचर एज यू नो वी ब्रिंग यू द नेशनल आई सी टी अवार्डी टीचर जर्नी ऑन एवरी ट्यूजडे एंड थर्सडेज सो टूडे इज Tuesday I would like to invite on screen uh, Mr Kankan Kishore Datta he is the assistant teacher of uh, science in Baman Pukhuri High School Jorhat Assam Mr Datta namaskar and a very warm welcome so he is the guest and uh, today uh, we are uh, you know invited him so Mr Datta what is your journey uh, we would like to know more about it though i am very lucky i i have uh, you know i i have witnessed the 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 moment when you uh, you, yeah. you know are right, right. being awarded this ict award this is a really a prestigious award in the field of education so i would like to know more about it uh, with all my audience uh, and my viewers yeah uh, uh, sarma ji actually uh, i am lecture teacher but uh, more a learner mm -hmm. uh so uh you know uh, so uh, as you have uh, already introduced uh, me uh, so myself kankan kishor datta mm -hmm. uh, son of uh, lila kanta datta and my mother is reena datta and uh, i am assistant teacher of uh, bamun pukri high school uh, from jorhat uh, district jorhat and state assam uh so uh, first of all i would I like to uh, show you uh, my area huh so you can see uh, let me mute the video so this is the area assam jorhat district okay and this is my school near this pond and the way we always uh, communicating this is the uh, road road condition so you can imagine the our lives our lifestyle mm -hmm. and not only the teacher the difficulties that students have uh, always faced mm. so uh, so this is our uh, village and uh, as i have mentioned i am from jorhat district and uh, recently we have observed uh, lasit divas in 24th november uh, samaji you might probably know that uh, in delhi also our chief minister have uh, this uh, observed this lasit divas in a national wide manner mm -hmm. so that uh, our hero lasit barpukan uh, his uh, burial is also in our district this is the lasit moidan so i am just giving you a short intro about my district so that uh, viewers can know about not only me also my district as well right <clears throat> and uh, so in 2010 i have started my journey as a profession as a teacher hmm. so actually uh, sarma ji being a student is very easy but uh, learning requires the actual work and my learning and my actual work started in 2010 okay. so in my first goal initially i was you know uh, nervous uh, uh, how i will face the students uh, how am i going to uh, teach a group of people and uh, they also don't know me so initially a little bit of a struggle is there and uh, as the time uh, goes on i i try to observe students i try to communicate with them i try to get more close to them and uh, i try to know their problems the areas where they face problems and how i can help them to solve the issues hmm. so and uh, the interaction was uh, very good they also trust me and especially the staff i have had in uh, the tamil sega high school was very really, uh, you know very uh, they are helpful actually they helped me a lot and that uh, because i have uh, mentioned that this, this is a my learning journey actually so i have learned a lot about the students their the psychology their emotions i have learned a lot so uh, after observing uh, them carefully observing them i have uh, tried my teaching learning process i have tried to improve my teaching learning process and try to incorporate new things there also and uh, the students also uh, want to join 
uh, want to actively participate in some activities. They always not want to stay inside the class. So we have done a lot of projects also uh, in National Science Congress. We uh, our multiple uh, teams have uh, presented in state level also. So that was my first, you know, success with the students. So that time I was above the clouds that, oh, I have achieved that with the students. So uh, those are the sweet memories of my previous school. But unfortunately, in 2014, I have uh, changed my school uh, and the present school, that is the Bamunpuri okay. High School. Okay. And uh, uh, I want to show you my school very please, quick. Please, please, go ahead. This is my school and my students. Hmm. And uh, uh, in this school also, initially, uh, though uh, I have already uh, have a experience of four years, uh, but still I'm a little bit nervous here also because totally new environment. But here also very friendly staff and very friendly students. Uh, I managed to uh, cope myself with them. And uh, so uh, let's start with my first YouTube video. So okay. It's a, it's, a, it's a very amazing story, actually. Okay. Uh, you know, uh, I'm very fond of uh, electronic items, electronic things, especially mm -hmm. working with, uh, you know, IoT devices and all. Mm. Though I'm not an electronic guy, purely. Mm. Uh, so I enjoyed doing that, uh, those kind of stuff a lot. Mm. Uh, so uh, initially, I bought uh, a Raspberry Pi and uh, Arduino board and do some little bit of... Uh, tweaking stuff alone. Uh, initially, the, my first video was, uh, you know, aapko uh, hase uh, The first video was uh, like just uh, unboxing a Raspberry Pi Model B. Okay. So normally, the unboxing videos are made uh, for the new techs, new NFS. Hmm. But at that time, Raspberry Pi was a little old. Huh? Hmm. So, but that was new for me. So I have uh, uploaded an unboxing video and forgot about it. Okay. But one day, uh, uh, one of my students in outside the school actually, uh, he told me that, sir, I have seen your video regarding Raspberry Pi. So hmm. what is it? How to work with this one? So that time, that uh, something clicked in my mind. So uh, initially, I was taught that student will not uh, get any kind of interest from these kind of things. But at that time, I thought that, yes, I have to do some more things so that I can give these things to my students. Actually, uh, if we see outside Assam or outside India, the students are from very early age, they have the opportunity, they have the platform to work with this kind of uh, gadgets or tools. But in especially in Assam also, at that time also, the curriculum was not uh, so flexible that students have or they don't have the scope that they will work with this kind of uh, stuff. So then uh, I tried, uh, you know, doing more videos with uh, IoT devices, and uh, that uh, this is my YouTube channel where I have uh, uploaded all my videos, there, hmm. whatever I have made. Uh, I think I have a video of my second or third uh, IoT video. Uh, this is the home automation system. Turn on light. Sorry. Okay, please go ahead. Turn on light one. So this kind of, uh, you know, uh, works, this kind of projects, I have done alone. Sometimes I took help of my students and uh, they found it very interesting. Hmm. And uh, so I... Uh, Actually, I got uh, inspiration from them, encouragement from them that I have to post more. So I, uh, after the YouTube, I started my uh, website also. And then uh, one day, 
eventually I found the issue actually. Uh, so I have mentioned as the integer issue. In our class six uh, syllabus, uh, there is a topic of integer. For the first time, students faced the concept of integer. Up to class six, they know the numbers one, two, three, four, natural numbers. They know zero, nothing is zero. But when they have started class six, they have uh, come across the integer, the neg especially the negative integer. So it is a it is a very abstract thing uh, for the students because what is negative? They can they can uh, you know assume up to zero that nothing I have in my hand nothing that is I have zero. But what is negative? So to give them the concept of negative integer. Initially, uh, I tried with a model. I have developed a very low cost model. Uh, I named it as a number comp model. I tried the model. Uh, also, I showed how to uh, work with the model, created a whole video and uploaded in the cloud. I shared that video to the other students. For my school students, I have uh, demonstrated them in the classroom. But for the students who are not my, uh, not belong to my school from under school, for them, I have uploaded the video in the YouTube. For the teachers, I have uploaded that in the YouTube. So this model solves a very huge, very important issue. I have systematically analyzed the whole thing, and this model and this uh, the whole approach solve a very uh, important issue. So uh, after I have observing that this has already solved that issue, then I realized, then I prepare myself that using a mixed method will be very helpful for the teaching learning process. And uh, uh, this is the uh, model of the number of model, very low cost model, uh, you can see in the picture. So uh, next is uh, regarding the my Actually, after completing the model or after doing all this stuff, uh, my district uh, program officer, uh, I must mention his name, uh, he was his Mr. Uh, Mr. Paras Goswami, he called me one day actually. Uh, he called me and told uh, that uh, Mr. Datta, uh, there is a organization called, uh, uh, there is an event actually called National uh, Research Science Congress hmm. uh, organized by annually. You can give your project, whatever you have done, your idea, whatever you have done in a, by writing a research paper. So then I told him that, sir, I don't know how to write a research paper. I have really, I have totally no idea how to write a research paper up to that time. And uh, uh, Goswami sir was a person like that. He can make any hard things very light. So he told me that कौनसे बात है आप लिखते जाओ कोई प्रॉब्लम आ जाएगा तो हमें पूछ लेना तो I started writing uh, the paper uh, I have submitted to NTSC and uh, I have I never thought that NTSC will call me to present the paper hmm. but uh, luckily uh, I have got a mail and NTSC selected my paper for presentation so the that year it was held at uh, Ahmedabad and that was my first trip outside the Assam. <laughs> so, okay. Uh, we it, first time yeah. you uh, you know went outside from Assam. Yeah, for the first time I went uh, outside from Assam. Okay. And uh, uh, there I have presented my paper. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, student, uh, sorry, teachers, uh, postgraduate teachers, college mm -hmm. uh, professors uh, across the state and nation, uh, they have came and all everyone is presenting their paper. Okay. It's a three or four day program. Mm -hmm. So I have never thought that my paper will got selected as a best paper among mm. all these papers. Okay. So total 20 papers were selected. So among them, one of my paper is selected as the qualified paper, best paper in the ninth uh, National Teacher Science Congress mm -hmm. organized by Department of Science and Technology mm -hmm. in Ahmedabad. So uh, this is my first, uh, you know, achievement, a reward from an organization. Okay, and then uh, return from Ahmedabad, uh, I started with more energy with the students because you know, ha, one more experience I want to share uh, with you. Uh, 
uh, the feeling uh, when I I was returning from Ahmedabad uh, because it was my first journey yes, abroad. Yes, Abroad means my journey outside my state. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> And also, uh, yeah. uh, and also, uh, there can be a question, uh, you know, related this uh, journey and you know, return from Ahmedabad. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. When you, when you, when you leave, uh, you know, your uh, hometown first time and then right. came back, you know, to right. present the paper in the National Teachers Congress. So, uh -huh. uh, on the professional front, as you rightly mentioned, that you have started, uh, you know, teaching, uh, you know, with more energy. But on Indeed. a personal front, how was your experience? You know, in your family, um, how was it? Uh, yeah, uh, that was also truly amazing. Hmm. Uh, actually, when I was uh, returning from uh, Ahmedabad, hmm. my uh, actually I was quite excited. Huh? Mm -hmm. So uh, I I already called to my home and informed them. But I want to share everything personally. So okay. I was quite excited uh, during the returning trip. Hmm. And when I reached home, in a very excitement, I uh, um, I told everyone, my family members, I explained everything, mm -hmm. what, what I have done, how all the things stuff. But very, uh, you know, in a very uh, low voice, my father told me, okay, this is just a beginning. Mm -hmm. Like, like he is not happy at all, but I know he's very happy. Okay. Uh, that time, actually, he's uh, the voice uh, telling me that you uh, simply suruvati hai, apoor karna hai. So then I realized that yes, actually this is just a beginning. So I have to do a lot more. Uh, then I again reassembled myself and started my teaching with uh, more energy. So that was the uh, experience from my personal side. Mm. Okay. And uh, uh, next, uh, the stepping stone mm. in my whole ICT journey. The stepping stone was the, a initiative by SCRT Assam. Actually, that time SCRT Assam uh, organizes some organizes some uh, zonal workshops, zone wise, um, between three or four districts. They have uh, selected some of the teachers who have already used or who are very well aware about the ICT and ICT tools. So, SCRT Assam collected those uh, teachers and gave workshop, and from that workshop, bring some of the they get some of the teachers for other works. Who have uh, performed very well. So that workshop, in that workshop, uh, uh, I have to mention the name. Uh, like uh, we have uh, Sanjeev Kakati sir, uh, who is the joint director of ICT uh, department, assistant director Luxana uh, She was fantastic, and uh, Raju Burwa sir. So that ICT team uh, organizes the whole workshop, and in that workshop, I have learned about ICT in education. Up to this point, I know only ICT or information technology. But after this point, I have learned ICT in education. Because previously, I don't know, uh, I have not actually included pedagogy in my content, whatever I have prepared or whatever I have made for the student. Okay. Now I have rethink about the pedagogy, how to incorporate pedagogy in my content. Uh, so uh, all these stuff have, uh, I have, uh, learned from this stepping stone that is the initiative by SCRT Assam and thanks to the director ma'am for that, uh, you know, organizing such a wonderful uh, workshop. Hmm. So, uh, this is the uh, image, you can see the first uh, workshop, uh, zone workshop held by SCRT Assam, me, uh, this is me, you know, uh, this is me with uh, other colleagues, Raju uh, Sar, Sanjit Karadi Sar. So uh, here also I have first learned uh, about I can create uh, that I can create audio contents also for a teaching learning process. Initially, that idea was not came to my mind. Okay. And also I uh, uh, I learned here uh, about the ethical use of ICT tools, ICT resources, and materials. Previously, I don't know uh, from which source I have to take the resources or how to use them. So those, you know, very crucial things I have uh, learned uh, from this workshop. And uh, after learning so many stuff there, I tried to implement in my classroom. Though our infrastructure is not too good, only we have a single computer lab and uh, other uh, rooms are 
simple room. So uh, infrastructure from the side of infrastructure, we are somehow lacking behind. But still, we all the teachers try to give our best in uh, in our teaching learning journey. So then uh, another award uh, came to me uh, that was by an event called Dell Policy Hack organized by UNESCO and MG EIP uh, in collaboration with Dell. So uh, the event was like uh, teachers have to give uh, policy recommendations for uh, improvement of teaching learning process uh, using information and communication technology. Uh, where I have uh, put forward my view for opening of community radio in every school with very low cost uh, radio device. So that was my idea. I have delivered there and I have got second runner up in there. So it's a uh, another, you know, uh, 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 inspiration for me. So all these stuffs give a very new light. Uh, to my career and to my vision and to my journey. So after that, uh, I was uh, served as key resource person and resource person in uh, various programs to teach community, to teach teacher and uh, for their improvement of skill and professionalism. Uh, not only in ICT field, uh, after that we have tried, I have tried uh, very hard to uh, make the whole teaching learning process a complete package. So we have developed a lot of uh, innovative uh, low cost TLMs, you can see in the picture. The first one is uh, this one, the first one is uh, this one is, uh, you know, made out of uh, matchstick, used matchstick and rubber valve. Of cycle wheel, you know, somebody cycle ki wheel me jo valve laga hota hai, right, right, ji ji, under that, so wo wala valve use karke, these are the geometrical shapes, hmm. and these are the uh, broken panes and abacuses uh, for creating abacus, panes and beads using. Hmm. Uh, next, you can see these are the uh, low cost tailings. All are made by me uh, okay. from shoe box, used shoe box for mm -hmm. teaching reflection and reflection in classroom. Okay. And these are the pendulum using potato and rope and puzzle pyramids. <laughs> right. And so on. <laughs> so next, uh, Dixa is coming into the picture. Mm -hmm. So in the state, Dixa has started. Mm, so uh, during the phase of uh, starting Dixa in our state, uh, SCRT Assam had organized lots of I know uh, programs, lot of work, workshops at that time. So uh, from that workshops, I have learned a lot. Hmm. From that workshop, especially, I have learned about interactive videos, how to create them, what are the tools I have to use. I have learned about the 3D things, you know, how to create 3D. I have learned Blender and all the, you know, little bit high level applications I have learned during that time. And uh, not only from the resource person, actually, uh, Samaji, I must mention, hmm. I have learned a lot from my colleagues also, because right. all are coming from different states with different qualities. Right. So during the gathering, I have learned every, uh, from every person, I have learned it. Hmm. And uh, I also must mention a name of one of my friend called Vikas, a name that Vikas Bruva, also brother of mine. And he is actually expert of, you know, video making, video creation. Okay. So he teach me how to make a video more, you know, enjoyable, more, more appealing. Okay. Because before that, I, I created videos. I have never, uh, you know, uh, considered that aspect that it should be a little bit appealing. Okay. I randomly created videos uh, only uh, considering the aspects of pedagogy and all those stuff, but he he give me the thought that it must be appealing from the color perspective, from you know all the stuff, technical stuff like learning videos and all. So I have learned that type of things from my colleagues also during that journey. So after that, I have focused on uh, quality rather than quantity. So uh, I have tried new new things 
different type of e-contents for different needs for different uh, students. So type, uh, you can see uh, we have uh, created videos, we have created audios, interactives, interactive videos actually, mm -hmm. uh, games, um, websites that have already built by me, blogs for my school, e-lesson plans we have created for other teachers so that they can use activity books, ICT modules. So uh, continuously engaging with SCRT, we have involved in a lot and lot of different things and mm. created a lot varieties of, uh, you know, e-resources. Mm. Uh, here, I just want to show you a video. Okay. Uh, 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 this video is actually, uh, this might not be so appealing to anyone, but so special to every, uh, everyone. Mm -hmm. But this is a uh, moment of, uh, you know, uh, promotion of my uh, video from one stage to a different stage. Okay. Not too much is there in the video, hmm. but Please I have improved my quality. Yeah. Compounds in solution. If you look at the reactivity series of the metals, we always find that the more reactive metal displays the less reactive ones. You have probably come across similar reactions before. What happens when an iron nail is dipped in a solution of copper sulfur? So in that type of videos, actually, uh, somebody, uh, I have, you know, uh, improved myself from uh, the perspective of uh, content delivery, from the perspective of voice delivery. The whole video was pre uh, made by me, hmm. edited by me, voiceover given by me, script was done by me. Okay. So in all the perspective, I have improved myself. Right. Um, so additionally, uh, in Dixa, uh, we have made uh, the, uh, this is the picture you can see, the steering committee members, these are the steering committee members of Dixa State Assam. So uh, uh, that type of additional responsibilities are also given uh, to us. And after that, in 2019, uh, our Honorable Chief Minister, then uh, Mr. Sarvanand Prasunwalji, uh, mm. he felicitated me for contribution towards the Dixa. That was the time of 2019. Yeah. Okay. And uh, after that, uh, the, my perspective towards the audience has changed actually. Mm. Uh, initially, I uh, created contents for uh, a smaller audience that is only for my students. But mm. after that, I thought that as I'm growing my responsibilities get also, you know, growing up more and more. Hmm. So I have to look not only for the my students, I have to look after all the broad students, you know, from the view of the audience, first audience, not only to my school students. So I have to look after the students of other schools or my district or my state also. Right. So uh, we have uh, created uh, contents in five different languages. I personally created in Assamese which mm. is my mother tongue, mm. in English, in Hindi, okay. in Bengali, and in Boro, which is another uh, language of Assam. Okay. So in five languages, I have uh, created contents, uh, which all are available in Dixon. And after that, in 2020, uh, I have awarded the State Teacher Award uh, for working towards uh, e-learning in the state as well as in Dixon. So after that, uh, as the responsibilities are going, I have tried to engage the community also and mm. um, mobilize the community uh, for resources. <clears throat> Sorry, and try to help, uh, try to make better correlation between school and the community. Mm. So all these stuffs are uh, going simultaneously. And uh, in uh, my students also, I'm leading the students in various fields as uh, in science model and project competitions, they we participated in National Science Field and Science Congress also in Inspire Award in district and state level other competitions and programs like AR AR for Youth also. So uh, community students and the ICT all we together we are moving forward in this journey. Okay, so these are just some uh, snaps in uh, my classroom snaps uh, where we are delivering classes. Okay. Okay, uh, so uh, here I want to uh, 
show you a 360 video uh, actually i have to i can't show you here i have to open my youtube page differently or i can skip this one so Some if you it. so if you wish to uh, you know uh, share the video so you may go it so you may go for it i actually uh, it's a 360 now oh, i have to switch to the chrome please you may Okay. So, so this is the journey of uh, Mr. Datta is going on and uh, so far we have seen his journey you know uh, from the very beginning uh, to the extended uh, responsibilities you know to serve the better audience in, in a better way for the state and the you know uh, beyond the boundaries mm -hmm. of the state. Okay, uh, so uh, the, the, I have created 360 videos also. So okay. That, uh, yeah, I'm. Please make it full screen. Okay. Yes. Ah, yeah. So you can see this is a three total 360 video. Mm -hmm. So this is about the solar eclipse, and this video was uh, created in Blender. Shon, the ka baba. Hujjo, amar khoro jogo tor ek matro na khatro. Hokolu khokte moolit ko, ei hujjo kendro kori, gutei athoti krohe. So, I just just a glimpse, huh? Uh, actually, uh, why I was thinking of 360 videos because uh, normal videos students are uh, very well aware about that. Hmm. It, it, uh, 360 video is very new to them. Right. So when I created the 360 video and uh, I plugged up uh, my uh, phone in the VR set and give it to them, the the uh, you know the excitement the facial expression of student that that is uh, you know uh, unbelievable so they like the new things and new technology students like it very much so that's why i have tried different things like 360 vr videos i have tried and this is made in blender and uh, uh, another is uh, like augmented reality this is also a new technology so we have created uh, i have created uh, two applications in uh, AR. Uh, this is, uh, you can see, uh, AR app, where I'm uh, displaying the solar system. So, you know, uh, and the planets, this is uh, art, this is art, uh, displaying in the AR mode. These are the only the screenshots. Okay. Okay, so this is another AR app called the AR Shining. Uh, against the class uh, science textbook of class 10 it has been created uh, so there are seven different experiences so as the a student will scan okay okay mr datta can you hear me mr datta can you hear me So this is the uh, webinar session uh, which is going on. Uh, this is our 730th session of webinar and the speaker uh, is 90th uh, in the journey of National ICT Awardee. So he is Mr. Uh, Kankan uh, Kishor Datta. Yeah, and we are also. And okay. Yeah, students liked it very much. Hmm, please go on. And this is how we develop a lot of the contents. You can see uh, in Dixa, more than 90 plus uh, contents have been already uploaded. Um, okay. In Soyam Prabha, uh, that has been AR2 Soyam Prabha channel, more than 22 contents uh, I have created. In mm -hmm. All India Radio, more than 8 contents okay. already been aired. And in YouTube, I have more than 60 contents, uh, mm -hmm. each content for the students. So, uh, as uh, time uh, goes on and as I'm moving forward, the improvement in quality of the content. Mm -hmm. This is the demand from the student side also. So they need uh, more uh, quality content. They need very good visuals. They need uh, right. from all the aspects. Mm -hmm. So we have tried uh, very hard. And uh, I want to show you a very short glimpse of one of my content. Okay. So how we have tried to improve how we have tried to incorporate new things to our, uh, you know, e-contents. I am going to talk about the first time in the world. What is the first time in the world? The first time in the world is the first time in the world.
আর থিয় থিয় করে থাকা প্রতি ভাগে হয়েছে এক একটা বর্গ গতি সেই পর্যায় আর বর্গ সমূহ ওকে আই ওয়ান্ট টু সে শো ইউ দা নেক্সট ওয়ান অনলি গ্লিমস ফ্রম আর বিথ হুম হুম প্লিজ গো অন কিবা ইয়া দেখি সা মিথেন পরমাণু কেন্দ্রত এটা কার্বন আছে উপর ফালে হাইড্রোজেন আছে আর তল ফালে তিনটা হাইড্রোজেন তোমালকে দেখি সা এই আকারটো আমি যদি ইয়া ঘুরাই চাও এটো এটা বিশেষ ধরনৰ আকার ইয়া যদি আমি ঘুরাই দিও ইয়া বিশেষ ধরনৰ আকার so these videos are uh, these videos are more interactive than the previous you know, ones incorporate new things mm -hmm. um, rahul ji you might know that uh, preparing this kind of videos mm -hmm. are you know very time consuming yes. intensive and i can say so, uh, uh, the the recent videos are creator, are more interactive to all the staff alone sometimes right. sometimes we get a team luckily uh, but maximum of time we have to do all the staff alone in the mm. previous videos that have been recorded uh, by my friend mm -hmm. and uh, all other editing and other stuff all the 3d stuff or other visual effects all have to uh, done by but i must myself. say but i must so say that doing the... all the stuff in a low configuration machine is really hard the mm. editors uh, may and the content creators may uh, you know they can understand the pain of uh, doing all the stuff in a low configured machine so anyway for the students everything is possible uh, we try to create uh, and some of the android apps also for the students as you can see in the screen uh, this is a quiz app i have created for the students so that they can uh, play the quizzes mm -hmm. this is a app have been prepared during the uh, covid period uh, this is a dashboard at co uh, how how much covid is uh, spreading or regarding the covid data this is a card one is the period dictable app uh, for uh, upper primary students up to only up to uh, 20th element uh, next we have also tried to creating uh, create games uh, these are the two games i have created in the scratch uh, screen set screenshot of only two games uh, this was for playing with numbers and this was a virtual total virtual lab so after uh, entering the lab students ke, uh, can perform chemical reactions so this type of games we have uh, tried to prepare and try to incorporate uh, with our teaching learning process for a special child uh, especially for the visually impaired child i have uh, created the app called odilan so this is a test run i want to show you please if you have problem in viewing contents now you can learn it simply by hearing it learning is easy now shake the phone and say animal or plant whatever you want to learn animal you have chosen animal Animals are multicellular eukaryotic organisms. Animals consume organic material, breathe oxygen, are able to learning is easy now. Shake so the this is how the visually impaired student can give input to the application uh, either by voice command or by shaking the phone. Okay. Uh, so uh, all this stuff I have learned a lot from the uh, from the trainings held uh, by NCRT also. so i have attended lot of trainings held by cit and crt and i have learned various new tech tools and techniques from those trainings also so i must thank cit and crt for uh, such uh, tra trainings so now the story of the pool teacher uh 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 cit and crt uh, we all know how uh, every year they organizes uh, all in the children's education audio video festival and ict mela but this year it has been renamed uh, so uh, all year they have uh, organized this event and and the uh, in the 20 24th yes 24th uh, aic eavf i i was supposed to submit one entry for the first time huh? for the first time and Mr. 
मिस्टर दत्ता योर वॉइस इज क्रैकिंग मिस्टर दत्ता कैन यू हेयर मी हेलो आई थिंक देर इज सम टेक्निकल ग्लिच यू नो ड्यूरिंग दिस वेबिनार सेशन एज यू नो वी आर कनेक्टेड हिम विद हिम थ्रू ऑनलाइन वीडियो कॉल कनेक्शन सो आई थिंक देर इज सम इशू विद इट फिलहाल मुझे लगता है कि कुछ तो डिस्टरबेंस है जिस वजह से हमें बिल्कुल ठीक से उनका ऑडियो नहीं मिल पा रहा है मिस्टर दत्ता ने जितनी भी मेहनत की आपने देखा ही देखिए उनके एफर्ट्स कितने बेसिक से शुरू हुए और फिर उन्होंने एडवांस लेवल को भी एक तरह से अचीव किया जिसमें उनके फ्रेंड्स ने भी उनकी हेल्प की उनके कॉलीग्स ने कैसे हेल्प की मुझे लगता है कि उनके बारे में जितना भी हमने जाना उतना न केवल काफ़ी है बल्कि बहुत ही ज़्यादा उत्साहजनक और प्रेरणादायक भी है ताकि आगे चलकर जो और टीचर्स अब और ट्रेन हो रहे हैं आईसीटी की फील्ड में आ रहे हैं और हम सब जानते हैं कि कोरोना की का, का जो काल था जिसमें हम सब ने देखा कि किस तरह से आईसीटी ने एक एजुकेशन सेक्टर को बूस्ट दिया एक एक अपने कंधों पर खड़ा किया और उसको और मजबूत बनाया वहाँ पर इन टीचर्स की जो भूमिका है वो बहुत ही ज़्यादा महत्वपूर्ण है जब इन्होंने तमाम सारे सॉफ्टवेयर ढूंढे सोल्यूशन ढूंढे और कैसे हर उस विषय को जीवंत बना दिया जिसको बच्चे ये कहते थे कि इन क्लासेस में हमको पढ़ने में मज़ा नहीं आता है फिर वो चाहे सोशोलॉजी हो या जोग्राफी हो या हिस्ट्री हो किसी भी इस तरीके की तो इन हर हर विषय में टीचर्स ने इन इन सोल्यूशंस का यूज़ किया हम एक बार फिर से कोशिश करते हैं मिस्टर दत्ता आ, क्या आपको मेरी आवाज़ मिल रही है आ, मुझे लगता है कि आ, कुछ ऐसी प्रॉब्लम है टेक्निकली शायद हम उनके साथ कनेक्टेड करने की कोशिश कर रहे हैं मिस्टर दत्ता आपको मेरी आवाज़ मिल रही है आ, मुझे लगता है कि आ, कुछ ऐसा जैसे कि आप जानते ही हैं उन्होंने बताया था अपने विद्यालय के बारे में जो कि जोरहाट असम में है और हम सभी जानते हैं कि नॉर्थ ईस्ट की जो कनेक्टिविटी है वो बहुत बेहतर हो रही है असम में भी इस प्रकार की आ, जो है व्यवस्था है आ, फिर भी थोड़ा बहुत कुछ ऐसी गुंजाइश हो जा हो जाती है जब कनेक्शन कहीं किसी वजह से ब्रेक हो जाता है मिस्टर दत्ता कैन यू हेयर मी नाउ हेलो मिस्टर दत्ता कैन यू हेयर मी या या आई कैन हेयर यू हां प्लीज कंटिन्यू मुझे लगा कि शायद द कनेक्शन ब्रेक हो गया था जिस वजह से आपकी आवाज हम तक नहीं पहुंच पा रही थी यस yes, बीच में थोड़ा कुछ आया था प्रॉब्लम हम्म हम्म सो कैन आई कंटिन्यू यस यस अभी हमारे पास आपसे okay. और जान लेने के लिए 5 से 8 मिनट का समय है प्लीज गो ऑन ओके Uh, so the poor teacher ki kahani hui se ra and uh, you know uh, Rosana ma'am helped me to uh, give the entry fee for 24th all india children's education audio and video festival and luckily that uh, in that first entry i have got uh, the best audio award in the 24th aic epa and in the next year also in 25th uh, this is the uh, image from the 24th uh, festival but that 25th one was held virtually but in that one also i have got the best new media award so uh, as we are working with ict we try to ensure that every uh, every aspect of learning especially for the girl child so they will get equal and equitable opportunity so we tried giving girl child all possible opportunities in our school not only me uh, we together with our colleagues they are very helpful uh and uh, these are some of the pics i want to show you that we have uh, ensured all around development in our school with the help of our staff with the uh, good guidance of our headmistress who have uh, always inspires me always uh, monitors us and uh, guide us in on the process mm -hmm. so these are some of uh, the uh, you know publications so these are some mentioning about uh, my projects and this is a, a book by uh, dr nirmala sharma prominent educationist from assam uh, regarding action research so she also mentioned uh, in his in her book about my paper so after that pandemic hit it you know samaji everything was uh, stuck down mm -hmm. so uh, students got uh, you know uh, 
बहुत उनके लिए तकलीफ हुआ था राइट right. तो पैंडमिक में तो ऐसा होता है कि सभी लोग कुछ लोग बोलते हैं कि टीचर्स के लिए ये तो बहुत अच्छा टाइम है स्कूल तो बहुत टाइम बंद रहता है सो यू नो नो वन कैन बिलीव बट ड्यूरिंग द पैंडमिक टाइम टाइम आई हैव यू नो नॉट अ सिंगल डे आई वाज टुक रेस्ट अग्रीड एवरी डे वी इंक्लूडिंग द एंटायर आईसीटी I said to him with uh, the guidance of SCRT Assam mm-hmm. we uh, during the pandemic we have created lot of e contents mm. of all the different media we have tried video we have created videos we have created audios in the pandemic the daytime we uh, specially i uh, move uh, 35 km away from my home taking special permission from administration Hmm. and uh, record the video uh, in, in that uh, room uh, rented room and in the night we came back and whole night we try we edit the contents so uh, that way we not only me all the uh, our ict team uh, tried very hard during the right. pandemic time right 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 and uh, i want to also mention about ai so ai ai, AI is a very you know uh, fancy term in case of our will is uh, scenario but here also i have tried uh, uh, one of some of my students i have gathered some of my students uh, who have you know a laptop in their house uh, so not only student of my school uh, from uh, nearby schools also so that time government of india launched uh, ai for youth program so i encouraged them to participate in the program i guided them how to give uh, input there so some uh, all the students given only two stu- students have been selected for the second level in the second level uh that two students also uh, uh, given the next uh, improved version uh, by uh, taking help from their uh, guidance of uh, ai for youth fraternity so after that finally one of my student uh, get uh, selected and awarded in the national level uh, ai responsible ai for youth program by government of india uh, in collaboration with intel so a uh, boy from a village like us our village uh and going to that platform and wo bhi wo ai ki project mein so it was a fantastic you know uh, upliftment of the uh, for the uh, for that particular student uh, he also never vision that uh, dreamed of that uh, he will one day going to take this award uh, in the field of ai but uh, this had happened so uh, thanks thanks to all the you know involving uh, members then i have tried international collaboration also so and iasc is a campaign uh, uh, partnered with nasa uh, some uh, citizen science projects where uh, we have to you know identify uh, the asteroids so initially i have uh, tried i have also detected some of the preliminary detections uh, preliminary and uh, uh, yeah and after that uh, i took my students and i involved them also so these are my students who have uh, successfully participated in iisc campaign okay mr datta so, we have hardly 2 minutes so, for uh, you the, mr yeah. datta okay please yeah. conclude so uh, the inspiration of my whole journey came from all uh, my you know uh, my family members and especially my headmistress who have uh, taught uh, one day told me that you are like a elephant uh, who have a big ears but never seen the back <laughs> you are big Right, so right, from right. that inspiration, actually, initially I have never thought of uh, applying for a national award. Mm-hmm. But after that, I have applied the uh, national award, and the moment came. Mm-hmm. Uh, first, the national award to teachers have been declared, and I am honored to uh, get uh, the by virtually also, of course. Uh, but uh, I am honored, and after that, uh, the again the national ICT award back to back two awards came to my life. So. Um, i am quite happy and after that uh, uh, these are the some of the memories with uh, honorable vice president cm uh, education minister and the uh, journey goes on and additional responsibilities also uh, agreed yes no problem so uh, finally i just uh, in a short period of time i want to acknowledge the department of school education government of india cit mm-hmm. and crt for giving this wonderful platform Department of School Education, Government of Assam, Director S C R T, Inspector of School Jurhat, our headmistress, my beloved I C T team, my colleagues, especially my students, my <laughs> friends, and family members. 
wonderful wonderful Thank we you. are wonderful we are very glad uh, you know to know all these things from you and uh, you know i i can say all these things you know uh, came here directly from your heart from the, uh, as the as the inspiration for all the students or for all the teachers for all the colleagues you know those who are watching this session mm, it must be uh, uh, the you know uh, uh, a follow up uh, for all the for all their uh, steps you know uh, to taking uh, to taking forward this uh, these things you know to the next level so i must say uh, a, way, a many congratulations to you and uh, best wishes for all your future endeavors thank you thank you very much for joining with us for this wonderful session thank you very much and all the best again so this uh, webinar session comes to an end now uh, don't go away keep watching we'll be right back with the next session of sahyog in which we talk about mental well being and mental wellness of our adolescents and today's topic of discussion is screen addiction and health risks in children so don't go away keep watching we'll be right back namaskar <laughs>